Oh, that was a big fucking hoot. Oh, ho, ho, ho. good morning, everybody. I'm Baird, and welcome to an, oh, another entertainment on high. Oh, boy. <coughs> wow, excuse me. Entertainment on high pick of the week. We have a great selection for you. It was just put on Disney Plus within the last couple of months. I spoke to some friends of mine who saw this movie in the theater when it was making its run, and everybody I spoke to gave this movie a lot of praise. So, like I say, released in 2021, its rating is PG-13, its running time is just over two hours, I believe it's two hours and nine minutes, and it's Jungle Cruise. Here's the trailer for it. Like this, this is classic Disney, it's like swashbuckling action, there's a love story. There's a really creepy, scary bad guy. Um, there is a legend. In lots the of action. Of a tree that heals all. It could change the world. But if it gets into the wrong hands, it could awaken a great evil. I believe that the legend is real. Emily Blunt and The Rock were awesome in when this. When I do, just imagine the lives that we saved. I've been looking for this tree longer than anybody. I've tracked the legend to every It almost every island. makes you know, like, I mean, I understand that going to the theater is an experience. Like, I enjoy going to the theater once in a blue moon as well. But in Disney's case, I think a little bit more specifically, it's you see it as a trend that's happening. I've seen it with three movies now in the last six months where they'll do their run in the theater and then a month or two later I think it's two months then uh, then they're on Disney Plus so why the fuck would you go and spend 50 or 60 or however many dollars it takes to go to one of these theaters when you can just wait and in two months time when you're sitting at home with your family or your partner or by yourself, whatever, and you sit there and you smoke a blunt, pack a bowl, have a beer, you know, get or some fucking pizza or something, and and just watch it on Disney. Forget it. Hold on. Come on. Okay. I did that with Jungle Cruise, Shang Chi, and The Legend of the Ten Rings and the Eternals. Yeah, so it was just out in July, and I think it was on Disney Plus by. September, October, something like that. But like I said, it's a classic Disney action. It's like a really fucking good adventure movie. I couldn't recommend it enough. Uh, it might be a little scary for really little kids, but it's perfectly fine for ones that might be a little bit older. Uh, that's that's it for this pick of the week. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in and watching. Don't forget that hit to... Uh, Holy fuck, that, that fucking hit got me fucking really stoned. Sorry. Hit that subscribe button. Give us a like. And if you want to reach out to us, you can find us on Facebook or at entertainmentonhigh at gmail.com. Take care, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. That's right. I need more.